Hey friends and welcome to my June envelope stuffing. So a couple of things. Uh, this month is a little bit different. I am stuffing $820 and the reason for that it's not because I came into a huge amount of money. I'm actually refinancing my house so I will not have a, be having to give my June um, mortgage payment. Dun dun dun. So I will be using that to actually uh, get ahead on my, at least my sinking funds and um, so not my, so I'm stuffing both my sinking funds and my cash envelopes, yes. But my sinking funds, which are um, my Christmas, um, son's birthday, back to school, my niece's birthday in December, all of those I will be essentially uh, filling up for the rest of the year just to kind of offset um, what would be potentially, uh, my new mortgage payments a little bit more, but I lowered my interest rate and I shaved 10 years off my loan. So, yay. Um, so yeah, stay tuned and hopefully you enjoy this, um, cash envelope stuffing video. And that is my cat. He is now going to make an appearance and here we go. So the first envelope we'll be stuffing is going to be the gas envelope and we'll be doing this with $60. I put a envelope over here so it wouldn't fly away. I am stuffing my envelopes outside so we will see if money starts flying everywhere. <laughs> There's 20, 40, 60. I do not have anything left in my gas envelope. Next one will be beauty, and here we go. Um, I did go and go for a wax when um, it was safe to do so, and I'm going to do $75 in here. I already have $60. So now there's $20, $40, $60, $80, $100, $20, $50, $60, $70, $80, $90, $100, $120, $150, $200, $300, $400, $500, $600, $700, $800, $1000, $1000, $1000, $1000, $1000, $1000, $1000, $1000, $1000
Next one will be the back to school fund and I'm gonna add 150 to this. 60, 80, 40. All right. So now there is 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 50, 60, 65. So there's 265 back to school fund I use for his school uniforms. Um, also, school, school uniforms, any back to school photos or small things that we need at the beginning of the school year. Um, I already bought him his uniforms, but he will be needing some tennis shoes. And um, I got some new to us clothes, so he won't need any sweaters anytime soon. So he might get a new uh, coat this winter. We'll see. Um, next one is Fabian's birthday, and he will be getting $150 again with COVID. I'm not sure if we're going to be doing anything big at all. We might just do very small, like, cake. I'm not sure. But either way, I always like having enough money just in case. There's 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, because I'm also funding this for the rest of the year. And I'm doing it with 150 So 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 45, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And anything that might be left over, I'm just going to roll in for the next school year. And there's always things that we need for the school year, so I can use, um, oh, sorry, this is for Fabian's birthday, but, um, this, like, I can always buy him small things, like, um, breakfast. I don't know, just small little things. So let's go ahead and go count that. There's 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 2, 75 for Fabian's birthday. That might be too much in my opinion, so I might change that. Next one is going to be, um, a uh, cash envelope that I have for my niece and my boyfriend who are both born in December and I'm going to give them $150 20, 40, 60, 81 20, 40, 60 here. I still don't know what I'm getting them usually for my niece I might take her out um, for her birthday or buy her a gift certificate to get her hair done she is in college so I would try to give her something useful, practical, and something that she might not be able to just get on my own, uh, on her own, I mean. There is 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 65, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, so 275. And then gifts, I will be doing $30. Or $25, my mistake. Oh, and there is the $25. So everything worked out. I have a little bit in here. I bought some gifts, um, Mother's Day gifts um, for my mom, and then some small little things here and there. So let's see how much I have. There's 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36. So $36 is left in that. And that is it for this month's um, or this pay period um, cash envelope stuffing. I might have another one um, in the month. I'm thinking I might get a little bit of money back from my closing costs on my um, refinance. So stay tuned for that and I will be doing a video on my refinance. All right, so thank hopefully you. you enjoyed this video. Please like, share, and subscribe. Um, again, I know that I kind of messed up a little bit when I was talking about my son's birthday in back to school, but you know what I mean. Um, and excuse a little bit of wind that I had. but. I'm super excited. Um, look out for my video regarding my home refinance. And um, I pretty sure I might get um, a little bit. But I'm not doing a cash out refinance. I'm just doing a regular conventional loan. But um, I might be able to recoup some of my closing costs. So stay tuned for my refinance video. Have a good day.